Right guys, Joe Sexton here. Uh, I promised I said I was going to put another free online workout. So today we're going to be targeting the backs of your arms, so your triceps, or bingo wings as people call them. It's pretty hard because when we hit our legs and stuff, we've got big strong muscles to power us through these workouts. Whereas we're working our arms, they're a lot smaller, so they're going to fatigue a lot faster. So we're going to stick to 30 seconds exercise, 30 seconds rest, like I think we've done in the last two or three videos. Uh, we're going to start with the hardest exercise first, then we're going to get a little bit easier. And then we're going to get easier again. The first one's nasty, it's one of the hardest ones we've got. It's called a narrow grip press up. You've got to make sure that your hands are close together and your elbows are tucked in the by your side. They're not coming all the way together because there's too much pressure on the wrists and the elbows, but the hands are going to be round about, shoulder width apart, actually a little bit closer. You're going to keep your elbows flat, and what happens is we're trying to take away your chest and the front of your shoulders and try to get as much uh, work on the backs of your arms and your triceps as possible. So 30 seconds exercise, 30 seconds rest. If you're strong, you do these from your knees so that chest comes down the floor and back up. So the elbows are tucked in the by the side and back up. If it's too hard, you go on your knees again. Elbows have got to be tucked in the by the side and back up. So guys, so again, you've got to make sure your elbows are tucked in at all times. So we're going to go 30 seconds exercise, 30 seconds rest. Then we're going to go a little bit easier and we're going to hit a dip. So we're going to find a seat. You're going to come down to 90 degrees and back up. Again, come down to 90 and back up. 30 seconds exercise, 30 seconds rest. And then we're going to go for a full press-up. Makes it a little bit easier because a press-up, when we go for a normal stance press-up, means we're going to bring our front delts and chest into it, so it's not just the backs of our arms working, so we've got two of our muscle groups helping out a lot more. So your hands are going to be a lot uh, wider apart. Again, you can try these for on your feet. Again, that chest comes down the floor and back up. You've got to keep everything straight, that chest comes down as low as you can and back up. So you guys, we're just repping them out as fast as we can. If that's too hard, again, we'll just go on our knees and do them from our knees. Doesn't matter if you're male or female, there's going to be a point in this workout where you're going to have to go on your knees with that up. So we've got now good press ups, 30 seconds work, 30 seconds rest. And then we've got dips, 30 work, 30 rest. And then we've got uh, normal press ups, 30 work, 30 rest. I want you to do in four to five rounds of that. And that's it. Guys, you should finish it and you shouldn't be able to even lift your shirt off because your arms should be so dead. I want you to kill it, I want you to hit it so hard that. You've got nothing left to give. If you finish it and you're not sore the next day, we well, haven't worked hard enough. Remember, we've got to get ugly. If you want to look good, we've got to get ugly. Guys, I want you smashing it.